What's going on guys, today I'm going to be um, doing the Java for Beginners Module 3 Quiz. So the array date stores birth years of a group of people. You need to calculate how many of them were born in the year 2000. Uh, fill in the blanks to create a loop and calculate the results. So we have an array and we have to basically uh, Basically, find out if um, if someone was born in the year two thousand. So how we'll do that is um, length date start length. If the if the index or if the element equals two thousand, then we increment count by one. Then we output counts. Okay, so just as a reminder, if you guys want to pause the video and do the these yourself and then come back for the answer, um, you can go ahead. Um, actually, I would recommend doing that so you learn. So even if you mess up or fail, um, you're, 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 you really don't lose anything. So definitely do that. Okay, so we have a so we have an array with th three things in it. Actually, yeah, three things in it. So it'd be zero, one, two is the index, and then so we loop through the whole array, and then um, we put in what that equals essentially will. So we would have zero, one. Two zero one two, so zero plus two. I believe this would print out two. Yep. Okay. So we have filled the blanks to create an array of num of even integers, and then calculate the sum of the first and last elements, and I'll put it. So we have the we have res so even. Even right because we need to even because that's the name of the array, and then it's in the first and the last. So zero, one, two, three, three is the last, and then we output the result because that's what it is. Perfect. Okay, fill in the blanks to. Uh, to calculate the sum of all of, of all elements in the array are using a for each so we just do four and then semicolon here and then I believe we just L yep okay so the matrix has two dimensions and is composed of five rows and three columns. Fill in the blanks to add the last element of the first row and the first element of the last row. So the first element of the first row. So first element of the first row. So since there's um, first element, first row, uh, that'll just be zero, zero. And then the first element of the last row. First element of the row, last row. Hmm. Of the last row. First element of the last row. Hmm. Just be two, right? I think so. Oh, that's not right. Um, okay. So let's try this again. Okay, so let's read this close. Okay. So the last element of the first row. So the last element of the first row. So the first row would be what? Uh, last element of the first row. Hmm. 
So the first row would be zero, and then the last element would be two. And then the first element of the last row, first element of the last row, and this would be four. Got it. So that is going to end the module. Um, I hope you guys had a wonderful time here. Um, if you are finding these videos um, helpful, please like um, and subscribe. And I'll definitely keep these up. So thank you guys.